I did have the TV on and heard some fires in Napa, but I never thought it was going to be, you know, never realized it was going to come into Santa Rosa. My parents built this house um, 27 years ago with all the other uh, residents in the neighborhood. And me and my brother used to sit on this porch. Uh, we were homeschooled, so we spent our whole lives here, um, pretty much every day of our lives. And I remember always sitting on this porch with my brother, um, watching thunderstorms. And this used to be my bedroom. We had a, we had a porch chair up here that my mom would sit in on her lunch breaks because they work from home. Just looking at my home as a pile of rubble and water, is it's really heartbreaking to stand on the porch and look straight through. I can look over at where my living room was by the big tree to the left. Last year, about um, 13 months ago, we remodeled our kitchen and the family room. Uh, we had custom-built cabinets, top-of-the-line uh, quartz countertops, all brand new appliances, top-of-the-line stuff, four-door Samsung refrigerator. And my, my wife used to say, I love my kitchen. I don't want to move out of here. And uh, <laughs> the kitchen, I think, moved away from us. <laughs> I left my car, my second car, in the garage. <clears throat> and I'm kicking myself I, for not thinking of some way I could have saved that car. There's a lot of pictures, a lot of pictures of my kids. There is a whole box in the garage of pictures of me when I was a kid, you know, that we were going to get around to sorting out and putting into an album. <clears throat> I know that's gone. That you can't go back and retake photos of those who are, have passed away. It's that stuff that the little things artwork that I created when I was a kid. Yeah, it's just the stuff that you can't replace. Got a text from a friend that said, are you okay? And I said, yes. And I said, we're leaving. And I said, but I don't know what to take. And she said, let's see, medications, um, pictures, pictures, and your Bible study stuff. Our home was like, it's like losing a family member because we lived here for so long. And so you can, do before and after photos, but even then it still looks like just a house to anyone else. You, you can't capture the feeling of family and a lifetime of memories with my brothers and my parents. It's, I've tried for the past few days to describe it to different like reporters and stuff and I just end up saying the same stuff because there's no real way to describe it I mean, you'd have to go through it to feel the feeling that can't be described, and that's not something anyone should experience.